it's hard to explain to people sometimes because Definitely. they yeah because it's like some people just can't conceive that far back you know what i mean like some people just don't have empathy like i mean like i don't i could probably work on my empathy and stuff but like some people like they don't get they don't have it in the most literal sense you know what i mean where they can fucking like look back on history look back on how why look look, look back on how possibly the things that went down could be considered possibly a travesty a miscarriage of justice fucking genocide you know pick yeah. one you know like it, it, and it's this big thing and it's a big dominoes board where like if you accept that like this thing's bad you start looking yeah. at it and you go oh man <laughs> yep and i think that's what and i think that's what keeps people fr- i think that's what keeps people from from like trying to understand it because like it's 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 a whole bunch of if then you know what i mean it's like oh shit if fucking this privilege if this whatever instance of privilege is real then that means that that that's related to this which means that i also benefit oh no and like and just when you and then you look around and fucking just everything's a pile of bodies and some people are just too fucking weak to do that and fucking, right. or just fucking yeah i don't know now nah, they're weak fuck them i i yeah and i think the thing that haunts me like i'll be in the shower and just stop it's like Dude, I used to fucking run from the cops. Like, you know, like, I, I'd be like, hey, fuck you. You know what I mean? Like, like literally. <laughs> like, dude. Like, and I just think about, like, my friends. I'd be like, dude, I'm, I'm alive because of this shit. Like, yep. like straight up. Mm-hmm. I'm, I'm here yep. on, the, on the grace of my translucency, you know? Yep. yep. That's I it. Mean- I mean, fuck the police, dude. Like, I mean, oh, no, no, definitely, no, no. definitely, police. no, definitely appreciate, definitely appreciate that. Yeah, uh, I appreciate that you did that, and I hope you appreciate that you did that. No, but, I'm, but it's also, but it's also good that you recognize it. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like if that that you know, like you don't have to fucking hate the fact that you like ah, ran from the cops and fucking, oh, no, no. You know, like it. That it's fun as fuck. Like, but yeah, but it's but that's the key point that you yeah, but that you know, you know that you're like ah yeah. That part. It haunts me in like an alternate dimension kind of way. I'm like, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah. I'm like ah, oh, that's why I didn't get my next step on. Uh, yeah, those variables. Yeah, yeah. entirely. Sure. <laughs> I used to variables. go to court. I had no record. I I kept going to court, and I'd like uh give myself a buzz cut, and and and, and you know, and the the judge, you know, be like, you look like a good kid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're saying <laughs> community service. Yo. What does that mean? You look like a good kid. <laughs> Yo. Yep. Oh, fucking, yep. Yeah, the, dispar- the disparity. Fucking and that's one that like that's what that's one of the like common arguments. Why didn't you just why didn't you just comply? Why didn't you just do this? Why didn't you just do that? Because you'll probably be like because shit goes different for certain people because shit goes different like regardless of regardless of if you take those exact same actions you know what i mean like shit just goes different and people don't people just refuse to refuse to sometimes people refuse to accept that because that means that they're inherent like to them it means they're inherently wrong or bad you know what i mean and i don't think that I don't think that having that privilege makes you inherently wrong or bad. I feel like denying it is, you know, denying it is what is what does it because then you're fucking willfully you're you're becoming like an accomplice. You're becoming complacent in fuck uh in this continuing this fucking system that is not is not rigged in quite a few different types of people's favors um yeah um yeah like like nabahi getting into an argument with aesop rock (laughs) Rock? yeah 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 fucking uh nabahi nabahi was like i don't know i don't know how the argument started but fucking uh aesop was like you don't even do native art how come you don't do native art and nabahi fucking full-blood navajo guy was like Everything I do is native art. What do you mean? And yeah. It's like, I don't know. That's an example of deflection. That's another thing that comes up, like with fucking. There's a whole lot of, and that's the problem with partisan politics. It's so easy to fucking deflect. Like, oh, what about your George Soros? What about your Trump? You know what I mean? Yeah, like, what about is- the the left is a little more. The left is a little more. You know, you can reason with them a little bit more. You know what I mean? But 
there's but then but then they've got that superiority complex just because they're not nazis and i'm like right and it's like like the pacific northwest is a whole lot of fucking like unconscious racism you know what i mean Mm -hmm. where they where they think they're doing where they they mean well you know what i mean but like they just just you know they're just colonial they're raised raised that way just like like all all the other all the other little yakubians in the country you know what i mean like um and just because they weren't indoctrinated into some fucking crazy nazi shit like they still have benefited from that same privilege without notice so that it just fucking it gives them it it sort of blinds them in a different way i don't know man i think i'm just wilding right now no I'm, I'm, I'm very i'm very familiar with that because like you know my my parents you know they started this you know little commune and Ooh. they were super far left but then you know they'll come to visit and they'll be like ah these black lives matters protesters and i'm like what's wh- what about them <laughs> what about them? In, in that whole situation your problem is the protesters yeah like, and and you know they're you know they're from a different you know time they're from like the 70s and but it's that same thing they mean well they're not racist yeah 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 but if i said colonialism they would know what they were not familiar with that term yeah you know yeah. they they don't they don't they're not they're not on the internet yeah exactly <laughs> <laughs> you know? yeah, they're not in the boom facebook group yeah, and that's and, and I think that's the hard conversation you got to have with white people is like, hey, like you got to work on this. Yeah, and, and then the, oh well, and, <laughs> and it's well, I mean, it's tough for them because like, and I and I do like sympathize with them because like a lot of the time, a lot of the time, the reason that like a lot of the time the reason that they don't take as proactive a stance, um, you know, as they should is because fucking they have an uncle or something, or maybe even their mom or dad or something. And, you know, it's like fucking like, that's my fucking family. What am I going to do about them? And fucking, um, it's, uh, like, I mean, my, my knee jerk reaction is fucking fuck you, fuck your parents, kill them. But like, you know, like you can't do that. Like you can't do that. And it's, I understand that it's hard, but it's just something that people have to do. And like, I understand why they, I understand like in situations like that, I understand why it's hard to fucking stand up for it, but get, but you know what? It's not my problem. Yeah. No, I, I, I get it. You know, but yeah. And I'm just lucky enough to be like, I'm just the kind of person that's like, I don't really need uncles. I don't really get yeah. it. <laughs> I, don't need, I don't need uncles. It's really not that important. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> fucking. Oh, thank God, man. Fucking God. I'm, I'm very grateful for like my, very grateful for my family because i have a small family and like they and they have a pretty good head on their shoulders um and they're pretty they're they're pretty sound politically you know what i mean like they don't have any like really weird fucking like hang-ups uh with things and shit like every once in a while you'll meet someone like that or well there's a bunch of people like that in hawaii there's a lot of well-adjusted like people with healthy perspectives on like not just Hawaiian society but like society is of the nat- uh, on a national level and anyway point is I'm really happy that my parents and my family are my family because I have a small family and it would suck to fucking lose them but fucking yeah 